Hello and welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4 playthrough. So, in this episode, I will be helping the Overseer interview candidates. So I just have to find the Overseer. I think she is at the very uh, opening of the vault itself. Okay. Just a moment and we can begin. Please, step forward. Ah, yes. Welcome. Welcome. So, this here's a vault, right? Quite correct. And you could be one of our lucky new residents. You do got food in this vault, right? Of course. And a chance at a new life. A question or two first, however. What do you think is the role of a good government? Government? What the hell are you talking about? Do you know what government is? Some sort of old world club, right? But I don't want anything to do with that. I think we've got what we need. You won't do for our special assignment. But welcome to our vault. Your new home? If she is representative of what's left above. Mm. The outside world must be rougher than I imagined. Are you ready for the next interview? Let's continue. All right. Hello. Welcome to Vault 88. This is a real nice place you have here. Real nice. And I can go wherever I like, right? Within reason, yes. But I have a question for you. Sure, sure. What do you want to know? A hypothetical. Let's say the reactor core is melting down, and you're the only one who could stop it. Is there something wrong with your reactor? No, no, it's fine. Just pretend, so you can stop the meltdown. But you'd suffer from extreme radiation exposure. What would you do? Well, whatever you'd like. If you don't mind, I'm anxious to look around. How would we get him to really answer the question? Really answer it. Huh, fine. You want me to jump in a reactor for you guys? Please. Nobody's gonna do that. Hmm. He's got a point. Let's ask him why he's here, though. Why are you here? Just, Just come, come here to lend a hand, right? I want to do whatever it takes to help out. Yeah, I suppose. I think we could use him in our vault. As long as, long as you guys, guys are on the level, I'll, I'll give, give this thing a try. Honest. I appreciate your candor. You can stay, but you're not what we're looking for. Go ahead and get acquainted with your new home. What a colorful gentleman. Clearly he won't work for our experiments. Here's hoping third time's a charm. Yeah. Let's do the next interview then. As you say, hello. Welcome to your new home. Wow. A real overseer. I, I am so happy to be here. Hi. My name is Clem. Uh, yes. Clem, is it? Before you settle in, I have some questions. Oh, okay. Uh, sure. Uh, I'll answer anything you like. Well, uh, that's good. Here's the scenario. You've been assigned guard duty. You know, stand watch and make sure outsiders don't breach the perimeter. But from inside the vault, you hear a woman screaming. What would you do? You want me to guard something? Sure. I can do that. 
I can do that right now, if you want. But I don't hear any screaming, Lady Overseer. Hmm. Would you help the lady or not? Yeah, sorry. Well, if you tell me to guard, I guard. And I won't leave my post unless you tell me to. Is, is that okay? Another question for you. What can you tell me about your mother? Ah, oh, she passed. But she was nice. You would have liked her. She killed, she killed a mole rat once. Really? Uh, that's remarkable. And describe the traits you most admire about her. Well, she was strong because of the mole rat. And she, uh, uh, she, she fed me. God, I I'm sorry. Th this place is so much better than the ditch I was living in. Hmm. I don't know. I like him. I think we found our man. Gee, thanks. Uh, found what exactly? We're looking for a volunteer club. Someone to test some new devices that will help everyone. Are you interested? You mean I can stay? I, 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 I mean, yes! I'll help out. I like help. That's me, Clem. Always willing to help out. Yes. I think you'll do nicely. And no time like the present to commence. Now that we have... Um, Clem, we are ready to begin. The first step is to get him properly equipped and dressed. There should be supplies in the welcome area near the end. Awesome. Sweet. Clem, let's get you outfitted like a real vault dweller. Okay. Let's get him the apparel. And uh, what or where would be the pip boy? Uh, I'm thinking it's here. Did I miss it? Um, two. No doubt. You'll see. It's fully equipped, and I think I'm supposed to talk to the overseer. I think we'll catch up to you. Uh, what does it say? Okay. Finish this up. Hi. Our first vault residence. What a moment. But, on to business. Exercise is an inherently selfish activity. Instead of using every hour, every minute, to further the goals of the community, a resident instead improves their body past the minimum requirements. vault has devised a solution. The Power Cycle 1000. While you pedal, you provide raw power to the vault. A perfect answer to an inherently counterproductive practice. Uh.
I guess it's good in theory. Theoretically, that sounds all right. We just need to turn the hypothetical into actuality. The prototype is far from perfect. There were incidences during its R&D. Maybe even the stray cerebral hemorrhage. Let me download the schematic to your Pip-Boy. Build it and attach a terminal to choose the parameters of the experiment. Work Clem hard. Give me power. Well then. That'll be another episode, I think. Uh, so... I think I'll close it off here and, uh, well, we'll talk to you next time until I make, uh, yeah, so until the next time when I make another episode, I guess.